Hello people and welcome to my channel First Ever Tube where you'll get to know about the very first of the world. While some of us try to hide our ages as we get older, the universities around the world on the contrary display them proudly at every opportunity they get. This makes us wonder as to which university in the world displays the tag of the first ever. Let's begin. Since a university is defined as an educational institution of the highest level in which students studying are granted degrees in various academic disciplines, ancient education institutions like the Takshashila or Nalanda institutions both situated in ancient India cannot be considered as the first universities. As there is no record whatsoever of institutions like these granting degrees to their pupils, which is an important criteria for it to be considered as a university. Hence, al Karoin University is regarded as the first ever university in the world. It is the oldest existing, continually operating and the first ever degree awarding educational institution in the world according to UNESCO and Guinness World Records. Also known as University of al Karoin, it was founded by a woman named Fatima al fehri in 859 AD in the city of Fez, Morocco. The name of the university is derived from Kairwan, the city she was originally from. Fatima's family migrated to Fez in the early 9th century. Her father, Muhammad al fehri who was a successful merchant, left behind a gigantic fortune which was inherited by Fatima and her sister Maryam. Being a well-educated lady and financially independent, she decided to help people from her community and build a mosque with an associated school. The green roof structure lined with whitewashed round arches soon gained bigger proportions. It was built after being approved by the Idrisi King Yahya I. The subjects taught in the school were mostly influenced by Islam. Memorization of Quran Hadiths and Arabic language and grammar were taught in addition to vocational science and Islamic law. Interestingly enough, al fehri is also known as the founder of the first ever library in the world, which was situated in the university itself, boasting of a collection of over 4,000 manuscripts. Students from all over the world came to study there and it produced numerous scholars who have strongly influenced the intellectual and academic history of the world. Among these are Ibn Rushd al sabti Abu Imran al-Fassi, writer and traveler Leo Africanos, pioneer scholars such as Al-Idrisi, Ibn Khaldun, and many more. Non-Muslim scholars like Nicholas Kleinertz and Golias studied there along with Pope Sylvester II and Jewish philosopher Maimonides. Originally, the university was only 30 meters long and the present form of it is the result of a long historical evolution over the course of more than 1000 years. By royal decree, in 1963, the madrasa was finally transformed into a full-fledged university under the Ministry of Education, vastly including many subjects of the modern curriculum. Today, it boasts of an academic staff of more than 1,050, administrative staff of more than 700, and the total number of students studying in the university is close to 9,000. Since its foundation, al Karouin has served as one of the leading spiritual and educational centers of the world, and history will be witness to the fact that it was a woman who founded the first ever university in the world. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you did, make sure to smash the like button, share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe. And if you have any suggestions, do write down in the comment section below. Until next video, goodbye friends.